This is OnePlus Nord 4, and today I will show how you can fix the overheating issues on this device. So at the start of this video, I will uh, tell you how to prevent overheating, since while well, preventing an issue is way more effective, and or I mean way more efficient than fixing it once it ha has already occurred. So first advice that I have is do you do not overheat i mean you do not expose your phone to the direct sunlight for extended periods of time so if you use your phone outdoors just try to always stay in the shadow or if you have to um well for instance uh, li leave it laying somewhere outside just also keep it in a shadow of sort or even per even better if you'll just keep it in some case or bag whatever then another advice that I have, which will allow you to prevent overheating, is that you do not use the fast charging feature that is this phone obviously supports. Even though the fast charging is very appealing and well convenient, obviously, since it allows you to add power to your device way quicker than you would regularly be able to. Uh, sometimes, or I mean, if you are experiencing overheating problems, I, I reckon you just would prefer to not experience them, but and would ready to sacrifice those charging speed for, well, pre overheating prevention, should I say. And well, the easiest way to do that is to launch settings, then enter the battery category, go into smart rapid charging and switch it off. Or go into more settings here. Let's see if we can switch off the fast charging uh, altogether. Oh, I don't think we can. Here you can, uh, in the battery health uh, section, you can enable smart charging to optimize the charging even further and to prevent overheating from occurring even more with uh, even more effectiveness. Then, if the overheating already occurred, you can help your device to cool itself down a little bit quicker by enrolling the power saving mode. So open this page here and, well, switch it on. So, as far as this video goes, that will be it. So should you have any further questions, leave them in the comment section below. But as for now, thanks for watching and bye-bye.